Okay, so I have the new box from So Darn Tempting. I think this is the Christmas one, it's for um, December. So I thought I would just go through and open it with you guys. Just, <coughs> just look. Look how beautifully that's wrapped. Oh my God, and this feels really full as well. So the last one, I think I was totally in love with the tissue paper as well. We have mistletoe. That's going to be interesting. <laughs> I think we've had mistletoe up in our house all year round and my husband hasn't even noticed. But there's something else wrapped in here as well. So I'm really excited about this box because the last one was just amazing. The quality was incredible. <laughs> oh, that smells divine. That's like Christmas in a tea bag. I look forward to that later on. <laughs> That's really cute. I love to have a cup of tea when I'm sewing, as you can tell. So, let's have a look. A little message. I will save that one because it's a personalized message. And gosh, there is a lot in here. There's a huge amount. We have some wadding, feels like polyester. So that obviously we're gonna make something that we're stuffing this month. We have got a jingle bell, which is quite noisy actually. We have got a handmade with love button, two of them, it's different sizes. Maybe there's more, I don't know. Sometimes they get stuck on the bottom, so let's have a look. I have got another bell as well. So it's a red one and a silver one. Oh gosh, loads of ribbon, tons of ribbon. Uh, all cross grain, which is just always nicer to sew with. I, well, I think so, because it's, it's super strong, but that's just lovely, really good quality, nice and thick too. So that's fantastic. Look at those, look at the pattern on that one. Isn't that amazing? That's just lovely. So some ribbon and Gutemann sew all thread in a really nice red colour. Oh, Diamante sticker things, little, little diamondy bits and then oh more what's this so this looks like it is pre-cut and it looks like it's going to be iron on something it's got glue dots on the inside but I can't work out if that's interfacing or otherwise but I guess I'll find out in a minute, but there's a whole little bundle of those. And then fabric, which I'll come back to. That's beautiful. Another set of beautifully printed patterns. Oh, look, we're going to make uh, two Christmas decorations and a little mini stocking. That's gonna be awesome. A 3D origami snowflake applique stocking and a Christmas tree ornament. How lovely is that? Look at the way all of the instructions are printed out there so you can see how to cut out all of your pieces. Um, and then what I really love about these boxes is that Sam goes to particular detail to tell you about the fabric that she's handpicked for you, which I just think is really nice. We've got designers Sarah Knight, uh, Jilly P, Bethan, I don't know if I've heard of Jilly P, but that's for Dashwood Studio, which I have heard of. Uh, Beth and Janine, uh, Kona, uh, Kona Cotton, which is uh, Robert Kaufman, which I love. Um, and then all of the step-by-step -step instructions, which look at the detail of all of the instruction here. So this one is, yes, this one is a cathedral windrow pattern and a lot of quilters 
uh, you know that is for a lot of quitters that is the epitome of style is being able to be accomplished enough to do a cathedral window pattern so that's lovely and I can see that's where one of the buttons is going to go on so I look forward to having a go at that because it, I've always put it off until now I've got an applique stocking and then your origami snowflake so that's all lovely and then we have patterns on here and I really like how um, how these patterns are printed off because they're not tissue paper they're quite substantial paper they're very thick so you can use them again and again and again love that and also because I think they're all A3 yeah because they are A3 it makes them really easy if you want to photocopy them it means that it's really easy to kind of fold them up and copy them so you can have extra copies or even just keep your original safe which is quite nice so we have this lovely fabric. Oh, look at that. Is that. Which way up is it? Does it? Do you think it has it? Oh no, it is not directional because whichever way I hold it up, the bunnies are upside down. So this one. So this one is Sarah Knight, so much fun. That is quilting weight cotton. That is lovely and soft. Really, really nice. So there's pretty much that's a really nice blend of, of it's not just reds and whites I quite like the different shades of blues on there as well so that's really pretty uh, and then we have got this one. Oh, this is really pretty so let me open this up so you can see this one is am I back to front yes I am This one is Julie P. Merry and Bright fabric designed for Dashwood Studio. Um, again, this is a quilting weight cotton. It feels like it. Um, it's not too stiff. It's quite nice. But they're just really lovely. Really, really lovely presents <clears throat> all over there. And then we have got... Oh gosh, this is so classy, this fabric here. This one... Another quilting weight cotton. See how beautiful that is? That one is um, Beth and Janine Scroggin. Uh, a lady from Yorkshire. That's beautiful red work, we'd call that. One day I'm going to be good enough at embroidery to actually do some red work. Um, but I'm just not that good enough yet but this is very beautiful it's just lines it's really 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 pretty really pretty and it blends perfectly with this one so you've got a red plain solid color uh, this is uh, this is the Robert Kaufman and I have never ever bought anything by Robert Kaufman that isn't really top quality so that is beautiful and as you can probably see from my sofa I do quite like red so we have a very generous amount of fabric there again. So I cannot wait to get started with this. I'm quite excited. I've been putting off, the box came yesterday and I've been putting off opening it because I wanted to have the house to myself just so that I enjoy that, have that little bit of that moment for myself. That's awful, isn't it? But the other Murrays have gone out. So um, I am enjoying this. So I'm, I'm going to get, I'm going to start getting sewing. So bye.